I've completely lost track of what self-isolation this is. Eight weeks? Nine weeks? Who knows? I've forgotten. What I do know is that my kids are driving me crazy on a daily basis. I've had enough games and activities to keep them relatively busy for the first couple of weeks, but those have run out. If you're looking for some easy to make activities that entertain your kids during this time at home, look no further. Here are 12 awesome ones. One, sensory box. You can make a sensory box with just about anything lying around the house. Fill a box with random toys, shapes, cups, and sand, or even cereal with dried beans. It's a great sensory activity for toddlers and young children. Two, object guessing. Yeah, what a cute idea. Cut two hand-sized holes out of a cardboard box, a big cardboard box. Have your child hold a variety of different objects. And they'll have fun trying to guess what they are. You can use fruit, toys, all sorts of things. Three, scavenger hunt. Take an hour and map out a scavenger hunt for your kids. You can easily tailor the hunt to your child's age and make it a little bit more complicated for older kids. One's outside, one can be inside. Four, plastic bag painting. No mess painting sounds like an oxymoron but not if you add the paint to a sealed plastic bag. You can tape the bag to the window or table and your kids can paint using their fingers. Hopscotch. You need some painter's tape is all you need and to make an indoor hopscotch game, lay it out, you can lay the track any way you like it and away they go. Indoor track. Another great use of painter's tape. Make an indoor racetrack or train tracks for your kids to play on. The hardest, I think, origami. Beginner origami is something a whole family can try. As you get more confident, you can make more complicated designs. There's thousands on the internet. Eight, popsicle stick puzzles. Draw a design on a group of popsicle sticks, then mix them up and get them to put it back together. It's a simple yet fun puzzle that kids can put back together. Nine, mini putt putt course. Take an hour or so and, and create a do-it-yourself mini Cut course in your backyard. Kids of all ages will love it and you can keep them entertained for hours. Probably the funniest one is number 10, pom-pom racing. This is hysterical. Map out a floor course with, again, painter's tape. Give your kids a straw and pom-pom. They have to chase the pom-pom around lines of the tape. Now try and contain your laughter as you watch them race pom-poms. Backyard, number 11, backyard obstacle course. Create an outdoor backyard obstacle course for your kids if the weather is nice. If it isn't, do number 12, indoor obstacle course. And the weather isn't really nice, you can create one inside, and you can create one all around the house. Now that you know these 12 do-it-yourself activities, hopefully you'll be able to better entertain your kids in the coming weeks. You've got this power.